briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a landmark case in 1977, the United States Court of Appeals for the Seventh Circuit adjudicated the case of Metropolitan Housing Development Corps. This village of Arlington Heights focusing on the discriminatory impact of housing decisions under the Fair Housing Act. The issue began when the clerics of St. Viator, a religious order, decided to sell 15 acres of their 80-acre property in the village of Arlington Heights to the Metropolitan Housing Development Corporation, MHDC, for $300,000, with the intention of providing low-cost housing. The sale, however, hinged on securing proper zoning from the village and financial assistance from the government. When the village subsequently denied the necessary rezoning, citing unsuitability for low-cost housing, the clerics sued the village on the grounds of racial discrimination. The Supreme Court ultimately ruled that the village's refusal to rezone the property constituted a violation of the Fair Housing Act, as their decision had a discriminatory effect, even in the absence of discriminatory intent. Consequently, the case was remanded to the district court for evaluation, specifically to determine whether the village's zoning decision resulted in discriminatory effects. The district court's task on remand was to assess whether there was any suitable land for federally subsidized low-cost housing. If none was identified, then the village's refusal would be seen as an obstruction to the construction of low-cost housing, prompting the court to grant relief to the plaintiffs. The Fair Housing Act was interpreted liberally in this context, citing in favor of integrated housing. Moreover, a new district judge was appointed to hear the case on remand. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.